The spell increases your base speed by 30%. Well, that's pretty good, Renea, too. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get the summon. I'm gonna get the summon. Because I think that'd be good to start her off with that. Cool. Okay. All right. And now our big bro. Uh, okay. He's our persuasion bro. He's also very perceptive. He has arcane knowledge. Although I should probably do use magic device just in case. We get Treat Affliction and Acrobatics Mobility. Oh, that's it. I didn't get shit that round. Lulz. Okay, great. Alright. Let's go ahead and save it. In due time. Ooh. This box contains various household and hunting tools. You notice some good steel traps in the box. Use traps to help catch bandits. Awesome. <laughs> okay. I like that. <gasps> Carrots, cabbage, potato. That is not far. Okay. Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna have to look at this dude and uh, see if there's any anything we want to buy from him. There's some disgusting slush in the pot. This seems to be tar. Spill tar near trading post entrance to help slow down bandits. Oh, I like this. This is good. This is good. Also, can we take a second to just appreciate how cute this kitty is? No, come back, kitty! I want to pet you. Oh, don't run in the traps, please. Oh, God, kitty! Okay, thank God. Oh, my God. Uh, that would have been terrible. Oh, my little doggo! He runs, too. That's cute. Man, you know, I was really thinking I was going to get another character here. Hmm. An old well has been renovated and cleaned. It even has a new roof. Nice. Let's see if we can sell some stuff and buy some stuff. First, who are you? Who's Bakken? Oh, that's the potion bro. I'm Bakken, local herbalist. What brings you here? Tell me about yourself. Oh, whoops. I wasn't talking to you, Amazon Echo, you weirdo. Uh, where's this coming from? You want an old man like me to fight? Here, take this potion. Consider that. May help you in your fight. Oh, whoops. Okay, well. The bandits here bother you as much as Svetlana and Oleg. Maybe more. Help us get rid of them for good. Bakken scratches his head that hums to himself and puss his chest out. Well, all right. I'll show those troublemakers. The, the troublemakers. They'll learn better than to chase an old man around. Someone might even write up some verses about me. Maybe even heroic ones. Please be careful. Go ahead and help. But leave the heroics to us. You hear? Okay. Uh, some lore about him. All right. Cool. So he's going to help. Great. We need all the help we can get. As you guys know. <laughs> What is this? Oh! Whoa! Oh, that's nice of them. Well, very cool. Well, the uh, Gearbox just actually sent me the Banner Saga Trilogy on Switch. Well, thanks, Gearbox. That's, that's pretty cool. I've actually never played a Banner Saga game. Hmm. Awesome. How nice of them. Thanks, guys. Yeah, they sent me a nice letter, too. It's all handwritten and stuff. It's pretty nice. By the way, just just for the, for the record, handwritten letters go a long way these days. Just want to just wanted to say that. Big, big thanks for that alone. That's kind of awesome. I get so much boilerplate stuff these days that, yeah, handwritten goes a long way. What's up? Oh, they know. They know. By the way, guys, Letho. My wife just wanted to make sure you know. Letho. Just, just in case you were wondering. Letho. Okay. <laughs> Alright, we're taking a look. Okay, this is our first time in here. 
Um, actually, let me look here. Can you use this heavy crossbow? You use light crossbows, right? Yeah, what's the difference? Oh. So, in this world, if a weapon weighs less, it fires fa or gets used quicker. Is that how it works? So, even though the heavy crossbow does more damage, it's double the weight, so it would fire slower. No, that's not how it works. Okay. So... In this situation, chat, why would I ever want to use the light crossbow? Like, if, when I look at these stats, the only difference I see is that the heavy crossbow does more damage. But I know there's more to it than that. Okay, so people are saying the weight, but then... what? So what does the weight dictate? Just encumbrance? I should use the lighter one because it's cute. Okay. So proficiency. Okay. So you guys are giving me a lot to think about. I appreciate it. I, I will look into that. Okay. Um, oh, man. I wish I wish this was more fleshed out. I would totally read more into this. Although, oh, wait. You know what? Maybe it's in basics. Because that's what I am. A basic B. Um... No, it doesn't have, like, stats on weapons. Or weapons. Equipment, maybe? No. Huh. Maybe it'll unlock later. Anyway, okay. Appreciate it, guys. Thanks for the, the tips. Can I rest here? Oh, I can't rest here. Ugh. That doesn't seem right. Maybe I can rest... Okay, anyway, let's, let's look at what's going to happen here. Let me see his goods. I can sell this stuff now. I just, I just can sell everything, right? Like, sell the bucklers. A merchant would pay well for it. A merchant would pay well for it. A merchant would pay well for it. I'm hoping these, like, is, is this the merchant I'm supposed to sell to? I hope. A merchant would pay well for it. A merchant would pay well for it. A merchant would pay well for it. Okay, that's cooking. A merchant would pay well for both of those. A merchant would pay well for that, too. <laughs> okay. A merchant would pay well for it. An item of interest to a craftsman or a collector? What's this? Jasper. I'll keep one of the torches. A merchant would pay well for this. Oh, God, I just noticed. these. This is like old school Baldur's Gate. Jasper and Bloodstone and stuff. Oh, my God, that is awesome. Um, okay. Let's see. I can get a bunch of masterwork stuff. Maybe I just want to sell for now. I don't, I don't, I'm not seeing. Oh, he's got some nice, uh. Oh, a small bag of holding. Oh, dude. But 2500 Damn. Okay. I'm just going to take the money for now. Oy. All right. There is a speed option in the um, encyclopedia. Speed? I see spells. Formations map. Oh. I'll look this later, though. Oh, the dwarf has an extra weapon. You're right. Actually, a lot of them do, because we were going to sell this stuff. A ginormous sword. That's what it's called. It's called a ginormous sword. That's amazing. Okay. Um, I think I should get a better weapon for Ko. I don't, I don't think he's going to be using that at all. So you and you. Cool. All right.
That's how we want it. Just like that. Save it. Yeah, JC Wyman, there's a huge Baldur's Gate um, influence in this. Yeah, we already, we, I think we already got be. the bandit gear. I think I took it and sold it. All right, here we go. Let's do a hard save and see how bad this is going to be. It's going to be real bad, chat. It's going to be real bad. I'm hoping that our new level makes it a little bit easier, but we'll see. Let's get to the point you say the bandits are going to attack again. Who are they and when will they arrive? Who are they? The Stag Lord's gang. That's who. These lands team with bandits like bedbugs in a beggar's hut. And you just stirred them up. They have they have a camp not far from here. I expect they'll return in full force in a half day, maybe less. The Stag Lord won't take an insult to this lightly, and the henchmen are more like demons and men. How many bandits are there and what do they want? The bloodsuckers think they own this land. They come, they take what they want, and steal the better part of our money every month as a toll for their leader. They even broke our gates so, they couldn't, so we couldn't try to hide anything from them. Jeez. They claim they were collecting taxes. Why? For the stag lord and his cronies, of course. Okay. Dove, why don't you go start, start supper while, you, while we finish our talk? I need not be protected, protected from dark talk. I'm not some blind kitten, you know, and I've seen what they do to people. Most of the gang is made up of simple bandits, but there are a few monsters among the leadership, especially those close to the stag lord. Ox and Dovin from Nishrock come to mind. Okay. If you have nothing to fear, I'll help you deal with the attack. Okay. A box of alchemist fire. Alchemist fire? We could put it by the gate, light it off with a burning arrow when those bandits are nearby. But that could set the post on fire. Well, maybe if we covered the walls with something to protect them. All right, yes, I think it could work. I'll even shoot the arrow myself. Okay, great. All right. I think we're ready. Tell me more about yourselves. Okay. Save. Let's see how bad this is going to be. I beg you be careful and please don't let Oleg do anything too risky. Svetlana, go hide inside. We're going to go meet our guests. I couldn't rest. Yeah, I couldn't rest. Unfortunately. <laughs> Boom! We're just going to wait right over here for them to come to us. Oh no! Are they going for our boy? What a waste. Are oh, they going for our boy? Oh, good. Everyone did rest. Perfect. Start raging, girl. Let's see it. Let's get a song going. Summon, actually, let's summon a creature first. Mm. Why is he taking so long to cast? Eight seconds. Oh, dude, Oleg down! I think I think Boca just killed Oleg. Oh no, a bandit just destroyed him. Oh man! Wow! This won't kill me. Lost. I'll see. Okay, this is still going to be a really tough fight. This was not well, it's actually not going to be terrible. It's not going to be as bad as the last ones. But I think we're going to need to rush up and get in the way of Oleg. We can't. We can't have him. Um, we can't have him tank like he was doing. I can't wait to have an actual tank. Oh my lord. Those traps actually really hurt. I hope we can't set off those traps. This should do it. Oh, dude, those range guys just destroyed him. Oh my god. Okay, um, this was not part of the plan. 
I know, I need minks, right? Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to charge them. We'll, we'll try charging this time. Maybe we can sleep the archers? That's a good call. I, th I think we're gonna have to focus the archers for sure. Somehow. But for some reason, I don't know why Ko's cast was taking like 10 seconds. Um, I want you to be here. You can just you just go up and do whatever you want. You let's let's see if we can get this summon out. I'd like to see this summon. Uh, yeah. Damn, she's just getting destroyed. She's not even raging, dudes. Um. Oh, you shouldn't have done that attack, dummy. Hey, we slept the big guy. That's great, but I think we're dead. Um, you know, summon that dude there. Let's go down here. Oh, there's our little our little dude. Awesome. Cleric's dead. Okay, okay. Not done yet. Not done yet. Let's see if we can throw another sleep down here, maybe. Lost. Let's get you. Can we summon another one, maybe? Serves you right. I think that'll just replace the other yeah. summon. We're gonna check. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Part of the plan. Man, that was a lot closer, but we still have these range guys to deal with. What a miserable mm. last chapter. We had a um. We had a really rough uh, attack of opportunity, though. I think I need to. We're, we need to try. Yeah, the alchemist is blowing me up too, which is. I'm. I'm wondering if it was maybe better if we wouldn't have brought him. But I think I need to charge up with him, and that way, if anyone goes by him, it's an attack of opportunity. If you run behind the cart, will the archers follow you? I don't know. The only other way we could really get around this is if we were to maybe try to make the archers attack someone else. But I don't know if we want to do that. This spell's purpose is different. We're gonna put this like to here. And then you rage up and go in behind him. Let's see if we can summon maybe uh, an enemy closer to the archers. And maybe that will encourage them to attack them instead. And I still want to get a sleep going on back here because I think that's probably the in that regard. Okay, she is so much faster. Tear them apart! Right there, dude. Repent. I wish there was anything we could do with this guy, but if I cast a spell, then they get attacks of opportunity, right? And I can't drink potions either, so it's just like he just has to kind of sit there and not die. So lost. He's having a really hard time doing that, unfortunately. Lost. Survive. I always survive. We didn't get a sleep, unfortunately. That's a really unfortunate. Um. Oh. And there goes our big girl. And he's down too. Holy shit, man. Holy shit. Donk. There's nothing I can do at this point. I think that's that's it. Uh, he's about to get destroyed. Uh, this was not yeah. part what? of the plan. A miserable. That alchemist is almost uh, hurting more than he's helping. This is kind of unfortunate. Get out of sight from the archers. The problem is we want Oleg to live, so it's it's going to be tough. Um, I could try rushing them, but I don't think that would help. Try running the group all the way to the northwest so they blow themselves up on the traps. Yeah, like up here. But the problem is, again, like we have to. Who will kill Does it matter? You can see they're all going over. Now, can I trigger the traps? No, okay, that's good. Down there. Let's, let's see if I can just run him up. 
But man, the hits she's taking are so big. This won't kill me. Ow. How is he already dead, dude? Like, man. I, you know, the difficulty's bad enough, but now we have to do an escort quest. Oh my lord. It's like the worst ever. He's not dead? Oh, he's not dead, just unconscious. Oh. Really? I'll check him this time. Okay. I thought I thought we had to keep him alive, but maybe he just Oh. Random weather for the weather. That explosion didn't work because it's raining. Uh what the ah, shit is going on here? Interesting. God damn, just cast the heal spell, you dinguses. Oh, he looks pretty dead. Not dead yet. I don't know, he, he looks pretty dead. I could... Oh my god, he got critted for 29. Instant kill. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah, well, dude, here's the thing. You guys got to remember, this is the very start of the game. So we're, we're getting kind of trashed right now because I don't have an actual tank. I'm missing two characters from my party. Everyone's low level, and I'm still learning how to play. So, yeah, it's, it's just really hard. It's really hard, and I'm kind of okay with that. And if you're the kind of person that doesn't like watching a person fumble through this kind of stuff, there are, again, like I said earlier... There's plenty of streams playing this on, high, on a lower difficulty. So, if, if this is bothering you, I highly encourage you seek them out. It turns out hard is hard in this game. Yeah. But I kind of really like that about it. Because that means that when we're potentially 50 hours in, and we're doing a bunch of exploration and stuff, that it's like, maybe this is going to become awesome. And the challenge is going to be great for once for an endgame game. Repent! And we'll see. I'm going to go try to heal this guy. I'm gonna try to heal Oleg. I can't even see his life, though. Ouch. Nope. Yeah, every single one of these range guys can one-shot anyone they attack. Yeah, no, he's dying. He is dying. Yeah, so we're gonna have to figure out a, a better way to do this. Am I going to finish the game or just giving it a try? Oh, I'm planning on really uh, uh, trying this game. Like, I, I don't know if I'm going to, like, 100% it or how many hours I'm going to put into it. But I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm playing this game into the Done ground, dude. Waiting. This is happening. I am prepared. Oh, it's sorry. happening. Was lost in thought. Just letting the ink dry. Okay. I feel like we need almost need to. Mm, trying to trying to think about the ways we could do this the best, but I'm not coming up with a lot of great ideas. I feel like we need to bring everyone down here. Maybe. But then the archers are a problem. Okay, now these guys gonna you guys have to just stop and attack. Repent. What's up? Uh one one second, guys.
Damn the timing. Okay, as I as I've told you guys, my wife is uh, going to a um, is going go to a doctor's Your appointment today, and unfortunately, low. my son, who was normally gonna sleep until like three to four, is apparently not. Like he's already waking up. So I'm gonna have to go in probably like ten minutes. Or so. We're still gonna we're still gonna we got a little bit more time, but. This was not part of the plan. Is someone dead already? Oh, Ko, what the hell are you doing? Oh, you're already dead. You're a dingus, Ko. You know that? Oh, a dingus. I um, always survive. I does not survive. The plan. I always Please. survive. Bummer. That was not part of the plan, by the way. Yeah, control the pathing. Well, I had... I was interrupted that time. So, yeah. <laughs> Okay. I am prepared. Here I am. Let's try it again. See. No mistakes. I wrote it like I saw it. Mm, I could use more of the acid stuff, but that's only 1d6. Uh, oh, oh, it's a direct and then one point for the splash. Time's not waiting. All right, let's try it again. Now that did not work as planned. Am I? I'm not encumbered, am I? I don't think I'm encumbered. Did you use a sleep spell on Rowan? I wish, right? I feel like we have to set up here. Out of our story. Tear them apart! Kind of wish I'd gotten a summon spell on Ko. Look at me, Gorum! Well, you do you, girl. Uh, we'll be worse. Uh, and will be. Definitely will be. I Power chug those potions, I bruh. I always survive. Hey, it's cool. The two guys in the back, uh, they're still they're they're still awake. They're not going anywhere. You're good. Calm down. Not not yet. This was not. Okay. Wow. Yeah, the part that's 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 really really rough about this is um. Uh, the part that's really rough about this is the fact that even when we beat these melee guys there is still going to be the issue of getting to the archers without dying and then killing the archers. And we haven't even started going after the named guy yet. Um, yeah. We really need to get the archers down. I wonder if I can keep him alive over here. And Renea, you just kind of nailed what I was thinking. I wonder if we can kind of sneak around with these guys and go for the archers. This should do it. Oh, no! Who is this slow mother... In the background. Oh, you're the worst, dude. You just ruined my plan. You ruined my plan, bro. Uh, got one of the archers down, though. But I think he's about to die, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. uh, so <laughs> Oh, you gotta be hitting those, girl. You gotta be hitting those. Critical survive. hit for 20? For 20 survive. damage! Oh, my lord. Run, boy, run. Oh, good! A critical hit for 24! Okay. <laughs> Did I even buy armor? No, not really. No. Yeah, they do not mess around with the criticals. No doubt. That, I kind of liked, I, I feel like that could have worked if those other bandits hadn't interrupt our, um, our little foray into the other side there. I feel like this guy needs to be here as fast as possible. And then you, you go ahead and sing at the beginning and then we'll do a summon directly after. And then you two with me. Take 
Holy Pent! God, there's so many guys down here. Here's another slow-ass bandit in the back. Who is this dude? Oh, my lord. Um... Miss, miss. I have to summon next to him. Is he alive still? He is. Don't you move! What are you? You're gonna get him at? Your life ebbs low. Oh lord! Oh lord! Oh. And Oleg's dead. Chroma Prime just released. Nice. Terry Cleary, early impressions. Hard is hard. Um, hard is hard. And outside of that, it's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's pretty awesome outside of that, to be honest. Uh, I'm kind of really enjoying it. But hard is hard. Hard is hard. Maybe I should get, like, some plate for one of these guys. Mm. Can he wear medium armor? Oleg will get up if he finishes the fight. Okay, so even though it's saying he's dying. Okay, okay. Thank you, chat. We'll we'll try that next time. I know what to do. Yep, these fights have been super difficult so far, but it, they've felt so good when we have uh, finished them. So we're going to keep doing it, man. We're going to keep doing it. And damn it, we're going to win this fight. It may be hard, but it's going to happen. This girl really cannot be missing. <laughs> go down! Also, how does this totem thing work? I don't feel like it's it's the the beast totem thing we got. I don't feel like that's working. Um, maybe it is. I'm not sure. Yeah! Could be close. Oh, good. My tank died. Okay, great. Uh, where's the summon that you did? Is he dead already? Okay. This should Go after do this bandit it. here. Go on, okay. Great. She's about to die. Calm down. Not dead yet. Right, that guy's a lot faster than I thought he was. Oh, it's okay. My guy killed me, and then I'm pretty sure killed himself. Protect me, please. What? Okay. <laughs> the totem is for unarmed combat. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? Let me reread the thing for Beast Totem. Um. Hmm. Maybe I didn't quite understand that properly. Well. While raging, the barbarian gains two claw attacks. Okay. So I I need to unequip. I need to unequip her sword when I rage? Or is it automatically making her attack the two attacks? The totem gives you claws. If you already have a big two-hander, those claws don't help you at all. That's confusing. Um, can I move the traps? I don't think I can move the traps. I can try. 
I'm gonna try this, and we're gonna see what happens when she rages. <laughs> maybe if she like, maybe she actually grow claws or something. Traps can be used to help. Oh All no, okay, we can't do anything. Oh. Why are you guys walking all of a sudden? That's weird. Oh, it's the bandits, but that's fine. Oh, all mine. Alrighty. Well, chat. Hey, buddy. Here's here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Uh, I have to go now and watch my son. This little guy right here. Yeah. Hi. Uh, I'm probably gonna go ahead and keep trying this fight, but I'll go ahead and record it. And uh, if if I do manage to beat this fight before tomorrow, then the first part of the stream will 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 play whatever the fight is, and we'll go from there. So yeah, should be fun. But anyway. I want to thank you guys so much for being here today. Um, it is uh, it's been it's been an interesting day. I I don't I'm a little conflicted about this difficulty because I really want to play this game well, like I want to play a lot of it, but I also don't have 300 hours to try every fight for two hours. So I'm not I'm not really sure what we're gonna do about that. But then again, I'm really worried that if I drop the difficulty. Then these fights are going to get easy, and I'm going to regret it strongly later. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, I don't... I, I'm still deciding. I may try to... Like, I, I still kind of want to get to the point where I feel like I have a party. And I'm definitely not there yet. So... I don't know. We'll see. But I'm going to keep trying tonight on this difficulty. I'll see if I can beat it. Maybe I'll get lucky. And um, also, maybe we'll raise it up later or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But regardless... I'm out of here for now. Um, big thank you to all the subs, tippers, and and uh, cheers today. I really do appreciate it. Uh, there's a lot of names to read out, but as you can see, I don't want to kind of be shouting right next to this guy like I normally do. So I'm going to give you guys a blanket huge thank you today. Um, I really, really appreciate all the support. Good vibes to all you fine folks. And thank you so much for being here. Um, sorry the schedule's so weird today. I should be back tomorrow morning with more Pathfinder Kingmaker. We're going to keep playing this, even if I do drop the difficulty or decide to. Uh, we will go from there. And, um... Yeah! We'll see what we're going to do. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, dudes, thank you so much for being here. Uh, I really appreciate it. I hope to see all of you here tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. EDT for more, uh, more of this awesome game. And I will see you guys there. Have a great rest of your day. Thanks for being here. And we'll see you later. Bye-bye.